Hi everyone, I'm here with another journal share for you guys tonight. Um, this is my second Christmas journal in May. <laughs> um, I've just been really inspired to do Christmas lately. I don't know why, but anyhow, this one's a little bit smaller than the last one. Uh, this one's a five and a half by eight and there's four signatures sewn in. Um, and there is a hundred and I think 160 pages and 120. I think it's 120. Anyhow, um, this is just a book that I reinforced the spine and covered the spine in red painted craft paper um, and then I just sealed the entire book and I just have some satin ribbon that I've fed through the the signatures there and tied in a bow for closure there's a lot of room for growth on this one and it is um, similar to my green one other than the fact that it's all in red now. <laughs> um, this one I didn't do tuck spots and doily spots and all that. This one is just very straightforward. Just the papers. Um, so there's a lot of room for journaling, adding photos. Again, no coffee dyeing. I just have some sprayed papers and some hand painted papers. Um, so this would be great for like a December daily or just your holiday journal. I'm going to just do a quick flip through here so you get an idea. Um, the center of every signature I've got large pocket and there's also a little tuck spot here as well oh, there's 160 pages yeah 160 pages <laughs> sorry about that guys it's getting late Yeah, this one had, I didn't do any embellishing on this one, which is quite a change for me. If you've uh, seen most of my journals, you know I do a lot. I usually do a lot of a lot of embellishments. I'm the very frou frou, but I wanted to keep these journals relatively plain so that. There is room to grow and add whatever you would like. I sprayed these with them. Um, some homemade watercolor sprays, some Lindy's, and some sp uh, smooch, smooch spritches, smooch, sm I can't talk, smooch spritz sprays, I believe it is. Oh my word. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't be doing videos this late at night anymore. <laughs> uh, that's another pocket there. And the paper is from the Recollections Christmas Noel stack, I believe, from last year. I love, love this stack. That's one of those that's very simple, but very pretty. 
The exception to that is the, at the start of every signature, these pages here are from uh, me and my big ideas Christmas sack from last year. I can't remember the name of the collection, but they're um, cardstock, so I wanted to use those for the the signature ends. I don't know if you'll be able to see with the light, but the sprays do have a slight sheen to them as well. So some just different colors, different variations of red. Pieces of 24 pound copy paper in here as well, it looks like. Also, one of my favorite sheets in that stack. And that is it. Um, simple yet, I don't know, classic and elegant to me, anyways. Um, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments and I'll be sure to get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you liked this and have a great night. Thanks, guys. Bye.